What's up, my lunatics? Welcome back to my channel. But if it's the first time, my name is Anastasia Luna and welcome to you too. All right, guys, today we are going to this gem of this universe, uh, which is Diana Ankudinova. And the song is Can't Help Falling in Love. Uh, for all of my uh, Russian uh, subscribers, yes, I will put Russian subtitles, but I speak English because my channel is international and I live in the States and I've been in the States for about 16 years. So that's why my, my channel is in English. But yes, I will put Russian subtitles so we can all all get along so super excited to uh, see this uh, song and I'm sure it's uh, just another take on uh, the famous can't help falling in love uh, and I'm sure they're gonna do something crazy with it so super excited but first if you guys like the video please give me a thumbs up because it really helps me out and if you like the channel itself please subscribe also guys as you know I'm a rock singer myself And all the links to all my stuff, my music videos, my social media, my Spotify, my iTunes, all this jazz, all of this is going to be in the description of this video. So please check it out. Let me know what you think. And let's go. Diana Ankudinova can help falling in love. It's a pretty short song, only three minutes. It sounds very different. Wise men say mm. Only fools rush you Ooh, That's interesting! Alright, let's stop right here because it's a pretty short song. Wow, I, I did a couple reaction videos to her uh, stuff, but when she was like 15, she looks a little bit older. I mean, like she's growing into an amazing, amazing, amazing woman, amazing artist. Um, very, very interesting arrangement of the song. I really feel like she should start writing music. I don't know if she does. I don't know how much control over the arrangement of the songs she has. But I feel like an, a person with so much depth and so much artistry would write an amazing music. So um, I would love to hear her own original stuff. Uh, for a contralto, when she went high up there, for a contralto voice to go that high and so light, it's so freaky. Because usually contraltos can go up there. They can go high up a little bit, but she has this like light, light head voice. And it's so freaky and so unnatural for contralto. This She is, like I said, she is the gem of this universe. Again, I cannot get over the fact how different um, the arrangement of the song is. This is really beautiful. All right, let's go. I guess this is the second verse. Her face is just perfect. That's freaky for a contralto. Wow. 
<laughs> wow. Oh, they're going to talk about her now? Wow, I'm I'm proud to be Russian. This is fantastic. I mean, we have Dimash, we have Diana. I mean, we have so many amazing singers. This is fantastic. Proud of my country. Um, I mean, the, <sighs> voice-wise, you know, one in a million. You know, you 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 hear people that can sing. You hear people with great voices. But this is just this is just so unnatural in a good way and so alieny. I mean like you don't just turn on the radio and hear a voice like that like th- there there were good singers around there are good singers around you know fantastic singers but you hear something like this and you're like I mean this this just doesn't happen and then I never heard her uh, high register her head voice go that high because I actually would never expect her to go that high because I actually didn't think it's possible for a contralto to go that high she is gonna get better and better and better and better and actually for voices that are well trained and uh, hopefully she's receiving some um, classical uh, training she will mature she will grow into her real voice by the age of like 35 40 so this is just the beginning can you imagine who she's gonna become Come at 35 I'm like she's gonna crack the universe open uh, it, this this is absolutely amazing I, I'm glad that she's singing I'm, I'm glad she is well this is a channel and I mean this is like a huge huge like federal channel I'm glad that she is popular in Russia I'm glad that um, she is on the surface and uh, I just hope she's gonna keep singing and singing and singing I know she's uh, studying in college right now I forgot which which one but like one of the main colleges um, universities in Russia and she's studying she's studying I, I think performance or um, she needs to study acting as well because she just she doesn't even need to move. I, I've never seen her really move a lot on stage because she doesn't need to. Like, you look at her and, like, that's all you need. Her eyes, her, her lips, her movement, is, her hair is just... Everything is amazing and her tears at the end. She really lives this song. Fantastic performance. Again, whoever did the arrangement of the song is a freaking genius. Absolutely great. Um, we're going to be seeing more of her, obviously, on my channel. And if you guys know more of the singers that come from Russia that are so amazing please let me know because I left 16 years ago and you know I'm kind of been out of touch of like what's going on in Russia especially in in, like Russian music scene and um, I'm so glad that now I know Dimash and Diana this is just like I feel like if they both sing together they will literally crack the universe open like the planet will like you know open up fantastic what a beautiful beautiful gem in this world all right, guys, my name is Anastasia Luna. Thank you so much for checking out my channel. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up because it really helps me out. And if you like the channel itself, please subscribe. Also, guys, as you know, I'm a rock singer myself. And all the links to all my videos, my Spotify, my social media, my iTunes, all of the stuff is going to be in the description of this video. So please check it out. Let me know what you think. And like always, stay tuned for some more metal.